All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rakakadash. Double honor to the apostles and the elders of GMS who will teach well, being great examples to his younger brothers. And peace and blessings, salutations, hopeful luck out there pushing his word and truth and in sincerity across the four winds in the name of the Behaw Bashim Al Shah, pushing to get up out of here. Shout out to the hopeful the believers and listeners that have came back to the obedience of the scriptures through faith in Yahweh Bashim Al Shah. All right, we're going into another, you know, spiritual, you know, evening report. You know, it's a lot going on as, as, as far as top, uh, prophecy, all right, as far as Esau, Edom, you know, pushing this agenda, this global agenda for his new world order, you know, and in which, you know, this man wants to father oppress the people of the earth, all right? He has a depopulation agenda. There's a lot of death, you know, being prepared, you know, there's a lot of slaughter, you know, being prepared, famine, you know, and all these things are talked about in the scriptures. And what we keep up with is the ways, you know, that we see it happening. All right. And uh, what I want to talk about first is dealing with this man's technology on how this man is about to present, you know, technology <clears throat> and bring technology to the forefront. Cause that's what you've been hearing throughout, you know, this whole pandemic is what trust the science trust the science trust the science you know trust technology you know we was able to get you know the potion ready so quick because of how far we've advanced in technology man and this man has been blessed on the left hand side all right with technology you know but his technology doesn't all right succeed the power of how about shima i was shot and he's boasting as if it does you know, he's boasting this technology as if it's above the creator, man. This is what is man, this is the mind frame, all right, that, that these elite, you know, they're, they're top scientists and, you know, engineers. This is what they think that they've surpassed, you know, the understanding and the creativity of the Most High. And they're going to present, you know, this new world order as an upgrade to society, as a safer society. You know, you need this, you know, you can implant this in you, we can keep up, you know, you'll never have to worry about crime, never worry about, you know, your children being kidnapped, you never, you know, they, um, uh, I seen as, uh, uh, elder brother Yasha Wumba, he did his latest news and prophecy, you know, dealing with how, you know, you have CRISPR, which is the gene editing, all right, CRISPR, which is the gene editing, um, a company, you know, that deals with editing editing DNA, you know, they have a lot to do with the GMO, you know, splicing the genes and foods and different things, but uh, CRISPR, which is a DNA, you know, editing company, you know, they talk about how they have, you know, implantable technology, you know, this is what they said, implantable technology, you know, that's been in is over there in Israel, you know, that has been 100% accurate as far as, you know, carrying cancer, man, in their trials, you know? So this man is finna produce, he's finna um, project, he's finna present his technology as, as the savior, all right, of this chaos that, that's coming to the earth. And he's behind the chaos. <laughs> you see, ultimately, how about Shema Shah is behind the chaos, but he's in the power seat. He's using Esau Edom to bring, all right, a lot of this chaos that's in the earth. And Esau Edom, He's working on, you know, he's setting up to present his technology as some type of savior, you know? That's why Yahusha said, they that will save their life shall, shall lose it. Because if you choose this system as an Israelite, and we talk to Israelites because these he's are there through, you know, they might well ride it out, you know? But the uh, you Israelites, you have a savior. And if you choose Esau, Edom, and his technology is your savior, you know, you're gonna lose your life literally, man. All right? You will be put to death. And a lot of you that take, uh, 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 you know, the MOB will die of nuclear destruction in the presence of the Lamb, all right? <laughs> and the angels, man. You know? 
it means what? Those chairs are coming the same time the nukes coming, so the angels are going to be <laughs> over the earth and the elect in those chairs. All right, as America is on fire, man. Different parts, you know, the world, these different cities are on fire, man. You know, America will be completely engulfed in fire. So get ready for this man to present all type of technology, man, because this man has technology, you know, that we haven't seen. You know, he has technology that we haven't seen. And that's why scriptures say if it were possible, he would fool the very elect, which lets you know this man finna bring out some, some technology and it's gonna seem so good to the flesh, man. That's why within this grace period, what are we overcoming? The flesh. You see, overcoming the flesh, man. Because this is what he's finna appeal to, all right, to the masses and to the flesh of the people, you know? People are gonna be in awe at this man's technology because it's gonna be so good to the flesh, man. You can do this, you know, you can think, you know, about buying something at Amazon and it's bought. You know, and then jump into currency. You know, as I watched the um, the other brother with Power Corn from Dallas, I mean from, uh, from London, you know, which is channeling GMS, you know, Fear the Most High 7 Bach. You know, if you want to stay informed, you know, very sharp brother in the spirit, you know, very sharp elder in the spirit, you know, him and um, the brother, Elder Ariel in Dallas, you know, that's why I said Dallas, but they are the ones who really started that trend of the World War Three, you know, algorithms, you know, what you see brothers do, you know, but um, that brother, he was going into the central bank digital currency, as you hear, you know, me mention often, you know, the CBDC, you know, which at the end of the day is going to be a global, you know, digital currency, all right, and we know it's going to be regulated by the MOB. But he was talking about the control that they're going to have, you know, with this digital currency. As, you know, they will have the ability not only to monitor what you buy and sell, but to limit what you buy and sell. You know, because let's just say you have, let's say you are working and you're getting paid a hundred, let's say credits, I mean a thousand credits a week, you know, a thousand credits in digital currency a week so you have a thousand you know digital dollars you know a week well with that system now they can say well look you can only spend a hundred dollars on groceries according to you know <laughs> they might have it you know to your weight to your height but according to your weight and height and the type of job you do you know you can only spend a hundred dollars on groceries you know, and that should be enough for your daily recommended diet. You know, well, according to how far you live from work, and you know, you only can spend sixty dollars on gas, and then you know the, mo the most of your money, you know, is gonna be in bills. You still gonna have bills, you see. But they can just show you just how they can, you know. Well, you can spend fifty dollars on clothes. You know, and after you spend that fifty dollars on clothes, you can't you can't purchase clothes anymore, man. You know, that's the type of control that this man is trying to have in the earth, man. This man, all right, is really <laughs> trying to be the most high and control every fast. He wants to control your thoughts. He wants to control your spending. He wants to control who gets rich. You know, who's poor. He wants to have complete control of every facet of existence, man. He wants to chip animals. This man is wild and out. You know, in the earth, man, a big badass kid that's in rulership. Like the scriptures say, woe to the old land when thy prince is a child. All right, it's a big badass child that's in rulership, man. You see? And then pretty much when you go to the EU, you know, switching topics, going to the EU, which uh, when you go into a lot of these ten horn countries, you know, what you go into, you know, Germany, Italy, you know, the, the, ne the Netherlands, you know, Germany, you see the UK, all right, but France, you know, you have a lot of these um, beast nations, all right, EU nations that are really pretty much, you can't go into bars or restaurants or there's a lot of things you don't have access to if you haven't taken that potion, you know, and they pushing it pretty much, you know, to be mandated, 
and Russia is like that as well. You know, it's pretty much you can't go, you know, to restaurants and bars unless, you know, you took in their potion, man. You see? So the EU is getting very draconian, man. And it's gonna come here. It always happens over there first, and then it comes across over here, man. America gonna, you know, it's gonna say the worst for last, man. So we're we're keeping up and watching these things that's going on overseas, but just listen to these different truthers, you know, how they speaking about how pretty much all these EU nations, you know, you you don't have access to a lot of things unless, you know, you have that potion. And then, you know, they're going into that digital passport, man. You see how everything is leading to the same thing, you know, the digital, the digital, the digital, man, you know? So all these things are happening at the same time. The second lockdown, we know we know this, you know, you got uh, 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 Joe Biden, he's saying he need to monitor him and Fauci said they need to monitor text messages because misinformation, all right, can kill people. You know, under the banner of misinformation, now they're talking about, you know, they need to monitor test messages, man. <laughs> it's, hey, it's gonna be very dystopia soon, man. And America, you know, America always, you know, is, is in this false paradigm of freedom and peace, while the most of the earth is always catching hell, man. That's how you know America gonna catch it the worst, man. You know? It's a very spoiled society over here in America. And then, you know, uh, I think you're saying like uh, in the UK, you have to, in order, they, they're pushing in order to sign on to the internet, you have to have an internet ID. <laughs> you know? So, hey, the, the word, we see the word is just going out full force, man. It's only a limited time that this word gonna go forth, man. Even with this look, you know, thing that's going on now, all right, you Israelites better use this opportunity to be edified and built up, man. And if you here playing around, all right, still goofy as hell, not taking nothing serious, man, and you just been here, you know, on this emotional kick while all this edification has been coming out, you know, and when they shut this thing down, it's gonna, you're going to be through. You see? You, hey, if you, ain't been, if you ain't been building in the spirit this grace period, man, it's going to show when, he, when these things are taken away, you know, and we come into a time where, all right, a lot of things, you know, are going to be taken away. So it's a lot, you know, happening, you know, within the earth that's going to lead, you know, to chaos and this place becoming a dystopia, man. This, this dystopia society, all right, is, is near at hand, you know. Esau Edom is in the spirit of pushing this thing, man. He's in the spirit of pushing. And how about Shemal Shah has him in the spirit of pushing, man. So we're finna see, you know, a lot of um we're finna see a lot of um uh, changes rapidly in the earth, man. You know, and this second shutdown is gonna be very, you know, <laughs> I think after this one. It's gonna. This is gonna be the one that's gonna cause chaos. Me speaking as a man, you know, it could, it could not, you know. But I think this second lockdown is gonna be the one that's really gonna bring more chaos. And then they talk about how, you know, death rates are up tremendously, man. You know, due to this thing floating around. You know, due to, you know, the gun violence. You know, but they say the death rate is up tremendously in the earth, man. So we here, man. You know, we in a time spoken of in the scriptures well hey we got to be built on your house child on that foundation on that rock you know be unmovable this gonna be the time we have to be unmovable man because that storm coming man you know that storm of chaos all right is to come so lord will you was edified just want to bring that out you know you know it's kind of lengthy this time but it's you know it's a lot going on you know and i have to kind of speak on these things in a general basis you know and you can go check all these things out you know, for yourself, you know, because, you know, my my channel is so sensitive. I really can't say a whole lot, you know, the channels I be on so sensitive. But, you know, I bring these things out still, and all you have to do is go look these things up for yourself, man, and, you know, have this understanding for yourself. 
you know? So Lord will you brothers and sisters edify to the next time I say Shalom.